Although bicycles won't solve all of our air pollution and transportation woes, they can help a lot. Let's encourage bicycling as an attractive option. Why not set some goals? 10, 25, 50% of the trips by bike. The city of Delft in the Netherlands counts half of its trips by bicycle. And that's in a country with the highest per capita car ownership in Europe. Once the facilities are improved, more bicyclists sprout up. Their needs include underpasses, quality bicycle parking facilities, showers and lockers at workplaces. Bicycle use will grow when there is access to trains, buses and subways. Cyclists need safe networks of bicycle routes. Bicycle groups have organized rallies to show how little space a bike lane would take up on the roadway. Using humor and theater, the message can be effectively communicated. Wearing a gas mask can help to illustrate the sorry state of our urban air. How about a pedal-powered bus? One is being developed called the Bicycle. Ten people could travel around pedaling together. As more people ride bikes, acid rain would diminish. Global warming would be put on ice. The air would be invisible again. Mother Nature would breathe a sigh of relief. Why not give cycling a try? Cycling is liberating. You set your schedule, not the bus company. You're moving along at your own speed, not stressed out in traffic. And you'll probably find that when you bike it, you like it. While you're riding around and feeling great, maybe you can compose a letter to your elected officials. Tell them that you're sick of acid rain and that you want the atmosphere to change for the better. That it's simple to do. That building bicycle facilities is cost effective and one of the cheapest and quickest ways to clear the air. All it takes is a healthy attitude. The simple act of riding a bicycle helps to put the planet on the road to recovery. It's not nearly enough to talk about air pollution. Let's cultivate and celebrate the air solution. Took a bike ride yesterday, saw a funny world at play, saw new bike lanes on the street, saw people and slowed down to greet green boxes next to blue and gray, posters for a car free day, saw families without a trace of fear and joy in public space, little power in full sway, I saw things in a different way, Le Monde I be class. La bicyclette Took a Gomburg, never shied away From what had not been tried With faithful friends there at his side Showed us we could turn the tide on Adam's mind In Kyoto and not go the way of the dodo Burning passport declarations Buried car commemorations Robin Hood through town he'd glide, inviting us along to ride the moon da bicycle. Le moon da bicycle. When the king of furniture decreed his actions immature, took a took aim at his crown and threw the people's gauntlet down, which some folks call buffoonery. How accurate they proved to be, for like the clowns of Yapery, his stock in trade was honesty, sparking fires mirthfully to melt the ice of apathy. Le monde Le monde à bicyclette 
Sometimes statistics only bore them, so we perforated dull decorum. Energize the public forum. What else can one do but adore him? Ask yourself and make a list. And for a spell, unclench your fist. For laughter is an activist. Look up now, see through the mist. Fiction like a lightning flash, dispensed with humor and panache, the moon a PC flash. Le monde bicycle. I only saw him a couple times in person where the tower chimes, raging at the climate crimes, with horns are honking, words and rhymes.